everybody. We are unboxing our new car seat for Wesley. We got the Nuna Rava and we got it in the color caviar. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up and we wanted to show you. Hey, I got something, something to say. I'm just so sick of hearing everyone complain. I know it's tough and I know there's pain. Okay, so we are just checking out the Nuna Rava. Um, it's really awesome. Also, I want to apologize really quick. My washer and dryer are on, so if you hear loud sounds, that's what that is. But I want to show you guys a couple of my favorite things about this car seat so far. We haven't tried it out yet. We're just testing some things out to see how we like it. Um, and then I'm actually going to go set it up. I'm also gonna go get our baby car seat and bring it inside and show you guys the difference. So we never carry Wesley in in a car seat anymore. He's about 20 pounds and he just doesn't really like to be in the car seat. He hates it anyways. He wants to get out and play and run around. So we never carry him into a store with the car seat. I haven't been doing that since pretty much he was like, I don't know, like five months old and I could put him in a carrier and wear him into the store because that was what worked best for us. So. I'm gonna go get that tiny little thing and bring it inside and put it next to this one. That one is the Pippa RX, in case you guys are curious. And I'll put the colors and the links down below so you guys can get these ones if you'd like to. But here is our Nuna Rava. I am so excited about this. So, like I said before, this color is called Caviar. Um, it's the all black color. So, a couple things I want to show you guys that I'm really. Okay, so this car seat can actually hold pounds of five to 50 pound children now that is a big range so down here you can see let it focus okay so you can see if we're rear facing you can do 5 to 50 pounds and then for forward facing you can do 25 to 65 pounds which is really awesome that it has a different that you can do rear facing and forward facing and it has this press to recline feature so I'll pull it back a little bit so you guys can see me play with this and then they also have different options to use it. So you can use lap or shoulder belt, lap belt, or anchors from inside the car seat. And then in the instruction manual, it tells you what is best for your car and for your weight of your child. A couple other things I like about it is it has cup holders on both sides. So there's a cup holder and the cup holders also can be put away. I have them open right now because I'm about to go install this in the car. And then it has this little calf support thing. So this is for rear um, facing children. And if they're over 40 pounds, it says this in the instructions, but if they're over 40 pounds, you wanna make sure you're using this. We are gonna use this for Wes too, just to give him a little bit more comfort there on that calf support. Um, I already took out the infant seat thing in here. This is what it looks like. So this is just to scoot them up a little bit higher and make sure they're sitting in the seat properly. So if you had an infant, this would go in there to and then your baby would go in there so you can use this car seat with an infant um, if you wanted to it also has little pads right here that would go over their legs and pads that go over their shoulders one of my other favorite things about this is to move it up so in the smaller car seat which this is totally fine for a newborn but you have to take these out and move them in the smaller car seat but for this one you have this latch up here and you can literally just pull this up and it makes this longer and bigger for your baby. So stinking cool, so easy to adjust for the size of your child. Look, there's the lowest one you can go. So, yep, we'll be playing with that, messing with that, trying to get the best fit for Wesley as soon as we get this installed and get him awake and get him in it. He's taking a nap right now. But those are just a couple of the things that we really like about it. I'm gonna go grab that other car seat. It's filthy and it needs to be cleaned, so I'm gonna bring it in anyways. <laughs> But let me go get that and then we'll compare. So I apologize for how dirty this car seat is, but I took the car seat out and the entire base and I'll show you guys how, where to find the little thing to take the base out. But this is so crazy. There, um, so we took the infant things out obviously a, a while ago since Wesley's almost one, but the difference between the two car seats is crazy. So let me show you guys this. Okay, so here is the difference between the two car seats. So this base, of course, comes out because you can take this whole piece into like a store or wherever you're going. Um, and then this whole thing stays in your car. That doesn't come out unless you're using a different car, I guess. But even then, 
that should stay in your car. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys where the little latches are on this one. So they are down here. So when they are in use, they are this way. And then see how they're red? When you snap them in, they turn green and this little part snaps into that um, main piece of your car that's like those little metal anchor deals. So that's what we did. I just pushed on those and it came right out. This one also has a leg that stabilizes it um, that goes from like the seat where it's at on the car down to the floor. So that's underneath, I'll show you guys that. But this car seat piece itself, just like the main car seat, is only like, I don't know, like six pounds or eight pounds or something like that. It's like the lightest car seat on the market. Okay, so here's our whole base. Um, this is the little leg. This extends and goes down to the ground and sits on the floor in your car just for like extra stabilization. And then I think what we'll do is we'll end up keeping this car seat, this newborn car seat for our next baby. And then for the baby after that, we'll end up getting a new one. They just released a new one that came out right after the Nuna Pippa RX. Um, and that one's a really awesome car seat too. That's their newest one. Super small, super awesome. So if you're looking for a good car seat, I'll go ahead and link all the nice ones below. Um, I got mine from my aunt and uncle's baby store, Babinski's here in Salt Lake. So I will link their store and you guys can check that out. But yes, so here's this one. Um, I'm gonna get this one cleaned up a little bit too. I won't vlog that, but let's go install this one. Okay, I've got you set up in my car. Hopefully you guys stay balanced and don't fall over. I've got my instructions here and I'm gonna wipe off this seat first because it's filthy. <laughs> thing's a beast. Wow. Ouch, my ring. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's see if you guys can see this. All right, so here it is just chilling. I know everything is dark in there, so you can't... Oh, there we go. Okay, so everything's just chilling. You guys can see I'm resting you on Taylor's car. Um but I'm gonna go ahead and thread the belt through and through that little trap door on the bottom, which I'll show you guys um, so you can see what it's looking like. And then I'm gonna close the door and snap the buckle in. Okay. Okay, so the belt goes through this hole and then it goes Sorry for the lighting. It goes through this. So this is my little trap door I was talking about. Um, it has the info on here. But it goes through there and then out the cup holder on this side. Let me just... Out the cup holder on this side. Oh, we can't see it. And then it's going to go into that buckle. So let me get it in that buckle first. All right, so here it is all put together. So there are little snappies under here. That Okay, so there are like two panels. So there's this first panel. Ooh, there we go. There it is down there, that thing and it has a button and then this panel comes down from the top and then it just sits like that you can put your cup holders down this feels a little um tight to like snap it closed so i just may leave it kind of up like that especially if he wants to use the cup holder but i will put the cup holder up on the other side so he can use that another feature i really love about this is when you are getting your baby all ready there is this little holder you guys, look at this. That is to hold your seatbelt so you can get your baby in easier. Um, unreal, so nice. Okay, cool. All right, so it seems to be in there pretty good. I am gonna go ahead and call my uncle and see if he can tell me um, if I did anything wrong or if this is looking totally good. Oh, I also wanted to show you guys. There's a little thing right back here. I don't even know if you can see that because it's so dark. Um, that little thing right there. You can stick your little um, pamphlet, booklet, in here. 
just like that so you always have it with you it goes all the way in but i need mine so i'm not gonna put it in there but cool all right everybody so i got the car seat in i would recommend watching a couple other videos um just to make sure that you guys are doing it right there's some people out there who are like certified to install car seats so check those people out I'll go ahead and leave some other resources down below for car seats, for car seat safety and all that, so you guys can check that out. But I got ours in and it fits pretty good and I feel like it's really sturdy. Same thing as before, I put those belts through here. I got that true tension door down. The one thing a video said that I watched was to kind of pull on that belt in there before you close the true tension door and press on it a little bit and twist the car seat so it kind of gives it some more tightness and then you also do lock this belt like that belt's not going anywhere so i'm going to wiggle the car seat just a little bit so you guys can see okay my camera's moving because my body's wiggling but the car seat's not so anyways the car seat's in there pretty sturdy i decided to go with the three because it felt it fit against the car seat like this car seat better so once we get him in it, I'll show you guys a video and I'll kind of show you guys how he's looking in it. But yes, this is what it looks like in the car. Let me let my camera clear up. There we go. It's looking so cute in the car. I absolutely love it. So I'll go ahead and put some pictures here too of Wesley. And then I will review it after he rides in it a couple times. So you guys can check that out in the next clip. everybody so it is a couple days later and we've tested out the car seat a couple times so I wanted to get back on here and tell you guys a little bit about it and some of the things that we liked so I'll put a couple pictures up here of Wesley so you can check him out in the car seat we absolutely love this car seat it is such an upgrade from the smaller infant car seat that we were using um, and I showed you guys the difference in the two sizes but it is seriously so awesome we have absolutely loved it a couple things that we really liked um, the top part I showed you guys before that slides up um, to adjust for the size of the baby which is so nice the clips on the front here that go across their chest um, those are really easy to move up and down so if you are adjusting the size or if your baby's wearing like sometimes Wesley wears like a really thin more t-shirt style and sometimes he wears more of like a sweatshirt as his actual shirt and so sometimes it gets just a little bit lower or higher and so to just be able to adjust that is so easy and then on all of their car seats, which I didn't know this before, but those little pieces on the side that I showed you in this clip, those are actually to put your car seat clips in so you can put your baby into the car seat a lot easier. So that is very nice too. Um, but there are just so many amazing features about this. They have little airbags on the sides um, and I'll show you guys a little clip of that so you can check that out. But yeah, such an amazing car seat. We've absolutely loved it. Wesley's really liked being able to sit up a little bit more in the car seat too. So that is our final review. We absolutely love the car seat. I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video and let me know if you guys have any questions about the car seat or want to see anything else about it and i will show you guys thanks so much bye <music>